A coffee shop in Shimokin is closed following an arson over the weekend. Police say a teenager is responsible for all that damage. News Watch 16's Nikki Cries joins us live from the Central Pennsylvania Newsroom with more tonight. Nikki? Julie, a lot of people in Shimokin are upset that Dunkin' Donuts is closed because they didn't have anywhere else to go for coffee and donuts. Today we also learned new information about the teenage girl police charged with setting the place on fire. Yellow tape surrounds the Dunkin' Donuts on West Sunbury Street in Shimokin. The popular donut shop is closed until further notice because of extensive fire damage. There's a lot of people that's definitely going to miss it, no doubt about it. A teenager is charged with starting a fire inside the restaurant on Saturday night. Shimokin police officer Ray Psycho says no one was hurt, but the place has extensive damage. Psycho says the fire was started inside the women's bathroom. The toilet paper display Spencer was lit on fire and within about a minute the entire place was filled up with smoke. The mother did explain that she's recently been put on new medication, but as far as for what reason, we're unsure right now. The 13-year-old who admitted to setting the fire is currently at a juvenile detention center. Many people who live in Shimokin are upset that Dunkin' Donuts is closed. Now I have to rely on myself to go to maybe a Turkey Hill or something where I don't like their donuts. I rather the donuts at Dunkin' Donuts, and I'm kind of dealing with it, but. I really miss Dunkin' Donuts. I go there every day. I get a chicken baker croissant or I get some coffee, Powerade if I'm dehydrated. I sit there all the time. If I have any like legal work that I need to do, I go there. I meet with my attorneys there. I'm going to miss that place when it, if it don't open up. Yeah, a lot of my friends go in there, get the cold coffee. Well, iced coffee, I guess it's called. People miss their local hangout and hope Dunkin' Donuts reopens soon here in Shimokin. Cheap, classy place to meet up. It's a location where you can meet up with your friends. It's the only thing this town has. Officials don't know when Dunkin' Donuts in Shimokin will reopen because the damage is so extensive. As for the teen who confessed to setting the fire, officers were able to confirm her identity through surveillance video shown on Newswatch 16. Nikki Cries, Newswatch 16, live in the Central Pennsylvania Newsroom.